Miss Mosby, I have a question. Okay. Why are you wearing uh, socks, Nike socks with slip on vans? You're <laughs> not supposed to. Get a shot of the shoes. So this is my fit. Okay, I got my vans from Amazon. I got my Nike socks from the clearance store at White Marsh. I got my pants from Target. I got my tank top from Target. I got my corduroy jacket from Amazon. And I got my Stanley Cup from Stanley.com. You heard it here first. Howdy, partner. Welcome to the below all town town of brown water. Water, where the air is sweet, the horses are a lot lively, and the water isn't safe to isn't safe to drink. Let's see what adventures we we, we can have ha have on, on the trail today. Today is August 29th, 2023. You may stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic where which stands one nation under God, individual, with liberty and justice for, for, for all. And now for some happenings around the town. Mr. Mr. Emerson some will, will, will be making chicken fried rice for, for lunch today. Try your meal in at the bar and, and you'll get Get, get, get a horse. Last, last Friday, we, we, we had a fantastic pep rally for, for, for our mayor and chair candidates. This, this Friday, Friday, we will be ha having a lack of luck. Just make sure to, to, to review the candidates' plat platforms on, on our YouTube channel page. <laughs> We, we, we are all ready, ready to be getting to fundraise for 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 our high, high, high school overnight. There will be a be, be a subway fundraiser on September 12th. Please or please order today. Slips have already already been sent out. So don't you you tell tell me you didn't get it. I'm the, the sheriff around the, the, these parts at, at least until Friday. To audition or not to audition? That is the question. Auditions for this year's Cookie Night Play will be on September 1st, 2023 in the auditorium during Village. All interested students, please, please see Miss Cardell or, or, or Miss Pellegrino for an audition packet. But now here's your weather report brought, brought to you by Tall Drink of Water. The official aquatic be be beverage of the morning, the morning show. When I'm on dried out and dissipated, I, I pour some, 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 some tall water all over my, my myself to get that fresh, wet feeling. Love, good job. Please do not put your dirty tissues <laughs> in the recycling. It's gross and they cannot be recycled. Dirty tissues go in the garbage. You heard it here first. I do not approve this message. A hoover threw the watering can outside in the jungle and- We don't talk about that. Okay? I need that watering can back. I need that watering can back. Hiya, that's a poem by John Marston. He wrote a lot of horses, so do I. I love horses so much, I open up a horse meat factory here in Brownwater. That's some good horse. Today will be stormy with a 49% chance of rain. Sometimes when my horses get hungry, I let them eat some rain. It gives the horses that yummy rain taste. Temperatures will be cooler today with a high of 80 degrees and a low of 71. So make sure to stop on by the vote. By the Weberman Horse Meat Factory serving the Great Brownwater area since 1191. That's all your rubber report.
now, here's some entertainment news. Hi, my name is Frankie, I'm 19 years old and I'm running for mayor. Hello guys, my name is Evan Dewitt, and today, for more entertainment news, I'm going to talk about the city of Toronto where my dad and I have visited on Tuesday and Wednesday during midsummer break. Oh my gosh, it was a lot of fun. Like, we went on the CN Tower, and you can see miles and miles of Toronto and surrounding suburbs. Uh, at some point, we went to this part of the floor where the floor is glass, basically, and you can see miles and miles of buildings on the ground. I was nervous, but when I was lying on the ground, it felt pretty weird. I was like, oh god. <laughs> but at least I didn't fall and hurt myself, thank goodness. Good time, I'm still in one piece. Besides visiting CN Tower, we walked around different neighborhoods. Like, we walked around Koreatown, Kensington Square, Chinatown. My dad and I loved Kensington Square, oh my god. It looked kind of similar to like, the New York shops and stuff, but let's just say it's a Toronto version of it. And you had like some restaurants and shops and stuff. You had like this market there. It was really cool. And we also visited this distillery district where it used to actually be an actual distillery back then. We just walked around and stuff. It was really cool. It is what it is. That's all for your entertainment news. Now here's the joke of the day. Cut. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Mrs. Happy birthday to you! Yeah! Yeah! Did you know that the gold rush of 1849 brought thousands of miners to the west? Entire towns popped up overnight called Boom. Boom towns. Once the mines would dry gold, the people would move on and the place became a ghost town. Boom. Cool. What do you call a happy cowboy? A jelly rancher? Ha 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 And... Yes? Get her on the street. Season... Three. David? One. What are you most excited for this school year? The weekends. Same. What are you most excited about for this fall season? The sheriff and the Fridays and Saturday and Sunday. So also the weekend? Yes, and also football. Black football. Black football. Go Beacons. But make chicken! Joe. Yo. What are you looking forward to about fall? They have this fall themed kettle corn at Trader Joe's that I love. It comes yeah. out every fall. That stuff's, that stuff's good. Insert picture here. And. Cut. Miss Mayor, why are you looking forward to fall? Well, because you know I'm obsessed with Squishmallows, so therefore, I'm loving all the new Halloween ones. Um, one of mine is missing right now, and I'm very... It's short. And it's not missing. okay. Um, I also love boots and sweatshirts, so I'm really excited to be wearing boots and sweatshirts again. It is almost sweater weather. Because I like the leaves and just hanging out in the fall. You heard it here first. Are you looking forward to fall? <laughs> um, watch this commander's lead. Mr. Bano, why are you looking forward to fall? For football. Duh! <laughs> That's right, make me look better. Back up. Back up. Dinner. Do you a little dance? Dinner. Do you a little dance? <laughs> Boom, Mr. Emerson. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah! <laughs> Outfit of the day. Outfit of the day. Harvard Polo. Alright, that enough film? Yeah. Why are you looking forward to fall? Because I'm just excited to be off of school. <laughs> Me don't. too. Cut. Why are you looking forward to fall? Um, I like seeing the leaves change colors and then fall from the trees and then 
throw them up in the air and play play with them. It's fun. <laughs> play the leaf files. What is your favorite Dunkin' flavor coffee? Um, French vanilla with cream and sugar. Nice. Ms. Bauer, what is your favorite Dunkin' coffee flavor? Medium iced coffee, cream, sugar, caramel. Nice. Yeah. Got it. All right, students. My name is Mr. Mason, and I'm here to teach you about English. Now, let's start off with a roll call. I'm gonna go around the room, and you please just tell me your names. Blue shirt, please go. Leo. Tio. No. Next. Next. Xavier O. Xavier O. Xavier O. Yeah, Xavier O. Zero. <laughs> okay, zero. Um. I'll just call you no name for now. You. Hasi. Hasi. Yes. Oh, okay. I understood that one. Next. Simone. Limone. Okay, Limone. Okay. Not uh -huh. Nice to meet you all. As you can see, I'm Mr. Mason. Now, what um, What do you all know? Oh, uh, wait, what about Nate and James here? Tate and James? <laughs> uh, hi, I'm James. And there's Nate right here. Paint? There's... I don't see no paint. Anyway, what can you tell me about English? I don't know. Son of a... <laughs> <laughs> what was that for? That was... I can't believe it. Disrespect. Tell me something, anything, just anything. What's this word? What's this text say? Uh, sub, sub teacher. teacher. Soup to share. I don't like soup. I hate it. At least so I, I agree with this kid. Uh, I want like soup. You're dead. Read. Let's get gardening. Three easy gardening projects for children. Be an eco-friendly gardener. Chapter one. Being eco-friendly means thinking about how what we do affects nature from tiny seedlings to huge trees and the animals that really that rely on them. Ah! Ah! I can't stand this! I quit! Oh dear. Well, we've wrangled cat cat and saved the town from the plague. What did we learn? Ta, 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 drink of water is a lot lying about its size. I told you. What other man's horse meat factory serves the greater round water area? That, that's a great horse. A happy cowboy is a jolly ran, ran, rancher. Oh, ha, 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 ha. From, from all that's us at the Har Harbor School morning, morning show, please have a tactic Tuesday. Please like and subscribe and peace sale. And my slogan is, vote for Joe, he's your bro, as I was trying to come up with a catchy rhyme. Sincerely, Joe Shepard, your pretentious Jeremy.